Hey guys, what's going on? Crusty Boy here, back today with another Minecraft video. Now I don't want you guys to get your hopes up, but I'm gonna be trying to do a uh, freaking, um, you know, uh, daily upload. Um, I'll try, even if it's just you know, like a simple run through in the war zone, looting chests and stuff. I could like, yeah, I could do that. Um, but yeah, today we're here with, yeah, another opening. Um, I don't even know what to start with. I guess we can start with buried treasures. But first, this is the first time I'm doing it post reset. I'm about to prestige, um, prestige eight. You know, um, yeah. Actually, one sec. I gotta check something real quick. All right, yeah, I'm back. So, um, I just wanted to check my pictures, and uh, the last. It's been two weeks since I prestiged. Uh, May twenty seventh. So yeah, about two weeks. Um, so here we go, one sec, um, Pocket Thunder, I'm gonna uh, surprise him, I'm gonna surprise him back, I love you this much, I love you this much, slash prestige, with that XD um, and then so once you prestige you get a point so you can see available prestige points of one and um, so I put four into kit cooldown so I got 20% and now I put it into econ so now I have an 8% economy buff because I have four points in there 2% each point and yeah so I mean it's kind of underwhelming because you don't get any eternal shard anymore um, but, you know I just figured I'd come on prestige for you guys and then uh, do our opening and we got our Jinji set on, so let's get into it. Uh, so we're going to toggle on the animations because I like opening in. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, ba -doom. Let's see if we can get anything good. Um, ooh, diamond. Ooh, we got a Mystic Timber, a Challenge Pass, two... Red's Legendary Relic, 250 economy ticket. Oh, also, I took all my... Oh, I... So I need, like, 40 levels or something. Uh, and I didn't want to use all my, uh, spinners. So what I did is I just took all the challenge XP that was in here. And all the battled XP. And I just threw it in here. I used the challenge XP. If you guys are wondering where that was. Uh, yeah. Now let's do some pots of gold. We got a stack of those. Pretty nice. Let's see, anything, <gasps> ooh, oh yeah, you can get luckiest armor, two pairs of luckiest boots, not bad, not too bad, we got an ore seed box as well, oh, we're gonna throw our special stuff in here as well, so with those luckiest, uh, pieces of armor, those are nice, actually, we're gonna get a ton of money from opening these, boom, we're just gonna spam these all around, boom, just like so, boom, let's see if we can get some good stuff. Um, that's what, oh, I don't know why I didn't say in chat, maybe we weren't close enough, but we just got two more pieces of the luckiest set. Now, the luckiest set, it's a collectible item that a lot of people like, and a lot of people think, I don't know if this is true, but they think that if you wear the full luckiest set, your chances of unlocking a shard increase. I don't think that's actually true. It could be, but, I mean, I, I've never tried it. And I've ripped basically a bunch of my shards, so. Alright, actually, oh, this might suck. Because I have every single piece except the helmet, just from this opening. And I'm not sure if I ever had the helmet. I'm not sure if I ever got it. Let me go, because I keep all of it in one chest over here. Uh, wait, no, where is it? Uh, where the heck did I put it? Oh, yeah, right here. Oh, I did have that. Okay, so I have a full set of the luckiest armor, which... Uh, I'm going to the wrong warp, which I guess I'll use, I keep on going to the wrong warp, what the hell, uh, I'll use it, uh, when I do my, sh if I, like, I gotta get a shard I haven't gotten before from these, so when I do that, I'll use the thing, alright, next up, farming runes, I, I forgot about these, and I probably should open them with, uh, ancient runes and legendary relics and stuff, but, you know, let's see what we can get, I mean, kind of, yeah, they buffed, remember from the last one, they buffed farming runes, like, a lot. So, they are pretty decent. Said I got an economy ticket. I wonder for how much. Uh, 
let's see. Yeah, 5k. It's like terrible. <laughs> uh, storm gen. Okay, kind of just throw all these. And then two decks of cards, which are disgusting. And then get rid of those. And let's keep opening these. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One. Okay. Wow, a lot of potato farm schematics. Interesting. Uh, Ancient Rune. Alright, not too bad. Uh, I think you can still get sea kit keys from here. I mean, at least you used to be able to get, like, farmer sea kit. Um, which they don't have anymore. But I think you can still get, uh, random sea kit keys from this. I think. I've yet to see it, though. I've yet to get a random sea kit key post-reset, unfortunately. But Another warp farm. That was pretty good. Ancient Two ancient runes. And then an economy ticket. I think I saw that. Yeah, economy ticket. Let's see. Any good money? Oh, story challenge pass. Not bad at all. All right. Yeah. So farming runes. I mean, they're they're pretty good. I actually. I know. Never mind. I was gonna say I don't actually buy them, but I do. So. All right. Now we're gonna be doing immortal artifacts. So 18 of them. 20 minutes each. Three. So that's six hours of. Mining World wins. Uh, economy ticket, 100k. Not bad. Uh, actually, we're just let's just roll it out. See all the pus. I mean, you can get some decent stuff from this. Uh, super cookie. Okay. Come on, give me some. Come on, I don't want orbs of immunity. I want some good stuff. Ooh, economy ticket for 250k. I mean. I have quite a collection, oh, Mystic Timber, yeah, like, I have quite a collection of economy tickets, um, wait, wait, did I miss me, uh, seven, I guess, because he's asking for guess. I don't know, oh, yeah, right, last time I opened all these, um, I got, like, a bunch of lucky challenge XP bottles, I mean, I'm getting some, uh, challenge XP bottles, just not the lucky ones, unfortunately, um, ooh, economy take another 250k, alright, uh, 10 ore seed box, let's go, that's, that's nice, and last but not least, challenge XP bottle, alright, not too bad, we'll throw all these in the chest, and then for the warzone credit, we're gonna just toggle, actually, we'll do one of them, toggle on, just so you guys can see this again, it's pretty cool, um, I obviously won't do it for all. Maybe I'll do it for more than one. I don't know. Um, let's see. What could we get? There's still an Immortal Stone. Uh, Ancient Runes. Let's see. What, uh, come on, Immortal Stone. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, uh, it disappeared. Hey, we can't, yeah. Yeah, we got trash. Alright. Uh, Alright, Warzone Rocket, I'll take it. Let's see. I don't think, you, yeah, you can't get shards. That would be cool if you get a shard, because then you could just see it flying kind of all around. That would be cool. Let's see, Legendary Relic. Uh, anything else really good. Some Emerald Blocks. I'll take the, I'd really like these Emerald Blocks, just for safekeeping. Uh, nice money supply. Come on, Emerald Block. Yeah! And three Arcane Shards, not bad. Uh, okay, now we're going to talk about this off. Okay, uh, boom. Let's see what, uh, ooh, two storm generators. Interesting. I don't know they could come in pairs. Are you kidding me? Another, no. They don't stack. Of course, they don't stack. If they, if, if it comes in one pair, uh, or two that come in a pair, they stack. The one, the other one doesn't stack. That's so annoying, but it's like, whatever. Uh, another storm generator. Let's go. We're getting so many storm gens from this. Uh, three more arcane shards. I mean, we're getting pretty decent stuff from the Warzone crate. Another storm generator. Jeez. Uh, some more emerald blocks. Let's see. Ooh, economy ticket. 500k. Let's go. Let's freaking go. That's pretty good. Uh, toxins. Alright, come on, give me some, uh, good stuff. More good stuff. 
I swear, I've gotten six storm generators just from opening wars and crates. Ooh, a buried treasure. Uh, we're gonna save that up. We're not gonna pop that. We're gonna save it up for the next opening. Uh, let's see. Transforming skull. And Enchant XP. Come on, give me something. I mean, I'll take this stuff like half a stack of emerald blocks and um, 500k. So I'll have seven storm generators. I mean, and that's only half. We've only gone through half the wars and crates so far. <sighs> economy ticket 500k. Let's go. We've gotten a mill in economy tickets from the wars and crates. Uh, or seed box, nice. Stack of gold box. That's always uh, well, very welcome. Uh, ch -ch -ch -ch. Let's see. Another or seed box, and I think it's a three. Yep, three. Called it. Um, let's see, come on, uh, a half a stack of emerald blocks and a stack of gold blocks, so let's go, story challenge pass and ancient rune, alright, alright, things are heating up with these, let's go, come on, give me some more good stuff, let's go, oh yeah, cell stones, ew, a half a stack of gold blocks, not bad, uh, ancient rune, nice, 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 yeah, in the next episode, I think we'll do uh, Myst another Storm Generator. Uh, next episode, we'll be doing uh, Mystic Tempers. And I think that'll be the last of the openings. And yeah. Another Ore Seed Box. Let's go. Alright, let's throw all these in here. Getting hella good stuff. Let's go. Uh, Arcane Dust. Eh. Yeah, I'm getting so many gold blocks from this. It's ridiculous. Uh, emeralds. Let's see. The legendary relic and story challenge pass. Nice. Not too bad. Ooh, challenge XP bottle. Any? Uh. Ooh, 2,500 guaranteed XP. Now that's nice. That is very nice. Uh, let's see. Come on! Come on! Come on! Uh, arcane shards. Yeah, I, th I think it only gives you in pairs of three, which is really nice. Half a stack of emerald blocks. Let's go. I'll take that. Another storm generator. I mean, at this point, sh should I even be surprised uh, at getting a storm generator? No, I shouldn't. Three custom name. I feel like all of this stuff, like arcane shards and uh, like uh, custom name frag books, they all call and come in pairs of three, which is interesting. But soul stones don't. So. Yep, three. Uh, oh, wait, no. I guess it's in two or three. Yeah. Uh, Alright. Economy ticket for 500k. I feel like I feel like that's got to be, like, the only price economy ticket you can get from Warzone Grades. Because that's all I've gotten. I mean, we've gotten 1.5 mil just in econ tickets. Um, Alright, for the last three, we're going to toggle on cosmetics. Just to see a little cool. Um, hmm. There's some decent stuff. I saw Mystic Timber, Ancient Rune, uh, Legendary Relic, or Seed Box. Come on, baby, come on. Let's see. Uh, ooh, Storm Generators are still in there. Come on, give me some of those. I could always. Ah, uh, and they're gone. And we got bad stuff. Let's see. Come on. Yeah, Ancient Rune, Diamond Blocks. Uh, yeah. Immortal Stone. Let's see. I don't, oh, there's. Uh, there was an economy to get, but it disappeared. There's still an Ancient Rune, though. Nope, not anymore. Uh, Arcane Shards, that's what I'll probably get. Yep. Five Arcane Shards, though. That's pretty good. Usually you yeah, get like three. Alright, last Warzone crate. Ooh. Um. Let's see. Orchid box. Diamond blocks. I think. Did I see an economy ticket in there? I don't even know. Let's see. Anything good? I mean, there's the ancient rune left. Let's follow it around. Huh? Oh, whoa. He's bouncing and he's gone. Um. Three random paper schematics. Uh. I'm gonna save those up. Uh. But yeah, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. 
watching this little opening that I did. Uh, actually, I don't even think Gingy affected it at all. I don't know if it works or anything other than um, Horsey Boxes, unfortunately. Oh, that could have been why I got the those two Storm Generators that one time, maybe. Um, could be, possibly. Who knows? Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this little opening episode. If you did, I want you to smash that like button, hit subscribe if you want to see more of my content, you know, all of those uh, YouTuber cliches, as always. Um, yeah, I mean, so yeah, next episode, we're going to be getting into the Mystic Timbers. We got 43 of them right here. Um, maybe I'll do confetti. I'm, I'm not, oh, actually, I might do Orsi boxes too. Open those up. Confetti, maybe. Uh, spawner spinners, I use, uh, spawner spinners are kind of boring. They make for a short video. So I, maybe I could do a combination of confetti and spawner spinners. Um, but who knows, we'll see. Uh, but yeah. Wait, where are, oh yeah, yeah. So, we now have a full set of the luckiest armor. And actually, we have four, three, we have so many boots. Uh, I'm going to showcase what the luckiest armor does when you wear it. It doesn't have a set bonus. It doesn't say anything. It says, uh, walking under a ladder, sitting in glass. Yeah, cool. But when you wear it, it changes colors, which is freaking cool. Look at it. It's a freaking rainbow. And, uh, yeah, so people think that, that uh, wearing this will increase your chances of um, unlocking a shard. I don't know if that's true or not. Um, I, mean, I, can always, I always try it. But yeah, it's just a freaking rainbow, which is amazing. Um, and actually, if I would give it a second to change to green. Now it kind of looks like a banker set. I mean, if you can get the colors right, it'll look like a banker set almost, which is kind of cool. Um, but yeah, so that's the luckiest armor. That's what I completed the set for today. And yeah, so like I said, hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.